Here is the Corsair computer case. A couple of months ago I did some modifications to this. Uh, I'm going to put the link to that video into the description, so make sure to watch that first, because I'm not going to go into what I did in this video again. Instead, I'd like to take a look at whether or not those modifications made any difference, whether or not these modifications were successful. We're now looking at the bottom of the computer case. Adding the feet to this case definitely improved airflow through the power supply considerably, as you can clearly tell by the air filter. This is almost clogged. It's pretty bad. It has never been this bad before, and that of course means there has never been this much airflow through the power supply before. If I uh, pull this out, a little bit of dust seems to have leaked through, but it's not too bad. So this was definitely a success, but I from now on, we'll have to remember to clean this filter a lot more frequently, maybe once a month, because, uh, yeah, that is pretty bad. Next to the power supply is this hole that I've opened up, because I had a feeling that the air filters on the side and the front of the case did not let in enough air. And sure enough, this did make quite a difference. When I was rendering videos, it took a lot longer for the fans to increase their speed. So definitely there was more airflow because the components remained colder for a lot longer. However, there is one major disadvantage to this, and I guess you can already tell, there is massive amounts of spider webs in this uh, in this grill, and as we look inside, look at that. That is horrible. What on earth? Look at th this. Is nasty. That is pretty bad right there. I've never had this fan being this dirty ever since I've uh, taped over all these holes in the case up there, and uh, I found this down here, which. Uh, you may or may not be able to see. This corner is absolutely filthy down in here. So, yeah, plenty of dust. So, yes, the hole in the bottom was a good idea, but it definitely, definitely needs an air filter. So, I'll have to see if I can find something similar to this and just... Uh, find a way to mount it on top of there, and then I can just clean two air filters instead of this one. So that's not going to be an issue. But until then, I'm going to put some cardboard over this hole because these amounts of dirt inside the computer are just unacceptable. So there you have it. The modifications on the Corsair Carbide series computer case were partly successful. Thank you for watching.